This week on GTV, we will be discussing a holiday trivia, a Christmas GOP, how to wrap Christmas presents, GTV caroling, a gingerbread house contest, and winter holidays. GTV starts right now. Welcome to our Christmas special. I'm Jenny Perrin. And I'm Reagan Reapy. Hey Reagan, let's go to Kylie to see what our Grizzlies know about the holidays. Hey Grizzlies, I'm Kylie Thomas and today we're going to be doing a trivia game. Let's go meet our contestants. These are our contestants. Name and their grade. My name's Lee Zhang and I'm a sixth grader. Why do you think you're gonna, your team's going to win? Um, I don't think we're going to win because I have no idea who he is. Great answer. <laughs> what is your name and grade? My name's Jackson Long and I'm in seventh grade. Why do you think your team's going to win? Um, I don't know if we're going to win because I don't even know what trivia we're doing. That's tragic. What is your name and your grade? My name is Kyla Gray, and I'm in eighth grade. Why do you think your team is going to win? Uh, because we're eighth graders, and we run the school. Yeah. That'll do it. Okay. <laughs> That'll do it. What is your name and your grade? My name's Harper, and I'm in eighth grade. Why do you think your team is going to win? Because sixth and seventh graders are doodle trash. <laughs> Facts! Next question. Who sang All I Want for Christmas is You? <laughs> Who's, who got it? Who got it first? Jim Carrey. No, 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 it was Mariah Carey. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. Correct! <laughs> Which country started the transition of putting a Christmas tree up? Multiple choice. Russia, Germany, Australia, or North Carolina? I was definitely me. I think it was me. Oh, was it Germany? It is actually Germany. Let's go. <laughs> what are you supposed to do under a mistletoe? <laughs> 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 what are you? Can, can we get an example, please? You're black. <laughs> <laughs> Please answer the question. How do you say Merry Christmas in Spanish? Feliz Navidad. That is correct. <laughs> What is the best-selling Christmas song? Me. Oh. Guys, it was definitely me. It was Harper. You know it? Okay, guys. Uh, Merry Christmas. That is not good. <laughs> <laughs> is that a song? Uh, we wish you a Merry Christmas. Incorrect. It was White Christmas. <laughs> what song was actually meant for Thanksgiving, but it's a Christmas song now? Ain't no one know that. Oh, I got Ain't you no one know that. Yeah, 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 you no. stood up. <laughs> Um, <laughs> a white Christmas? That's incorrect. <laughs> jingle bell, jingle yeah! bell, jingle bell rock. <laughs> Name all the reindeer. <laughs> uh, Donner, Dixon, Dasher, Prancer, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blixen. Who's the? Uh, yeah. What is the most popular movie in 2021? Christmas. <laughs> The Grinch. The Grinch. You are incorrect. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Do you want to take a try? Um, get the hell out of here. Oh, Frosty the Snowman. Incorrect. It was It's a Wonderful Life. Next question. How many ghosts show up in the Christmas Carol? It's a multiple choice. Wait, wait, One, wait, two. Christmas Carol. How many ghosts show up in a Christmas Carol? Okay. Oh. Okay. Multiple choice. Okay, sure, sure, sure. One, two, three, or four. Who did it? Me. Why are you lying? Why are you lying? Please. It was me. It was Kylo. Just that's him. Uh, okay. Three. Incorrect. Four. four. Yeah. Okay. Which of Santa's reindeer have the same name as another holiday mascot? What was the question? <laughs> <laughs> Which of the oh my gosh, <laughs> Which of Santa's reindeer has the same name as another holiday mascot? Cupid. Yeah. That is correct. <laughs> <laughs> Our winners, the Tyrannosaurus Rexes, with Kyla and Harper. Yeah. <laughs> Three points for toaster strudels. <laughs> toaster strudels. One point. <laughs> Whatever. How do you say? <laughs> Guys, this is a really easy one. How do you say Christmas? Wait, hold up. Harper, pull your pants up. 
<laughs> okay. Okay. Lisk and Kyla Green. Is that her last name? I should probably put some hair in the front. Uh, listen, I'm, I'm so sorry, but I don't want to. These are our contestants. Naming eight. <laughs> what is your name and grade? I look, keep it together. <laughs> First question, who, s wait, me, <laughs> I got it, congrats to the trainer of orders and whatever you want to call it that, <laughs> congrats to Kyla Gray and Harper Liss, now I'm signing off from GTV, I'm Kylie Thomas and back to you in the studio. Thanks, Kylie. You Grizzlies are so smart. Anyway, let's go to Trey for a Christmas GOP. What's good, Grizzlies? I'm Trey Shea, and today we're going to be doing a Christmas GOP. Let's go. Do you have any Christmas traditions? Yes. What are they? Uh, we, uh, me and my family do secret Santas, like, every year. Very fun. Do you have any Christmas traditions? Um, yeah, we go to my grandma's house, and we um, have, like, a talent show. Very fun. Do you have any Christmas traditions? Only Christmas tradition I have is eating ham and turkey and ham. All right, thank you. <laughs> I'm here with Miss Dyson. And do you have any Christmas traditions? I go to my mom's side of the family's house to hang out with my husband and kids. Thank you. Do you have any plans for Christmas? Yes. What are they? Going to my grandma's house. What are you doing for Christmas this year? I'm going to my Uncle Jimmy's house and I'm going to eat some bacon. Do you have any plans for Christmas? Eat a lot. Do you have any plans for Christmas? Yeah, I'm going to my grandma's house. We're going to open presents and eat bacon. Are you traveling anywhere for Christmas? I think we're going to Branson. Are you traveling at all for Christmas? Uh, no, I'm just staying home. What do you want for Christmas? Um, I just want everyone to be at my house. I just want a fun Christmas with my family. I'm here with Michael. And what do you want for Christmas? I want shoes. I'm here with Cheyenne. And what would you like for Christmas? Um, um, some shoes. And yeah, that's it. And some money. All right, thank you. What do you want for Christmas? Hmm. I want Xbox gift card. Yes. What do you want for Christmas? Oh. Uh, <laughs> I do the Xbox controller. All right. Thank you. What do you want for Christmas? My dad to come back. Thank you. Hope you guys have a great Christmas break. Now signing off from GTV for the last time this year. I'm Trey Shea. Now back to you in the studio. Thanks, Trey. Joni, did you see how to wrap Christmas presents? Yeah, but I heard Kay didn't know how to. Well, let's go to Abby to learn more how to wrap Christmas presents. Hey, Grizzlies. It's Abby Smith, and today we'll be wrapping Christmas presents. Let's go. What's your name in Greek? Adiria, and I'm in eighth grade. Do you know how to wrap presents? Yes, yeah, sort of. What's your name in Greek? Trey, seventh do you know how to wrap presents? Yes. What is your name? Cade. Do you think you're going to win? I think I can. Three, two, one, go. He's struggling. He is struggling. He is struggling. technique are you using? I don't know. You had a minute and 29 seconds. Now a minute 30. Now a minute 31.
Show the back, Sam! <laughs> Who am I here with? Noah Voucher. Do you think you're gonna win? Definitely. Start the timer, Joey. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> okay, he's starting. He's starting off with a rough start, but he's that's starting definitely. Off. <laughs> he's starting off rough. Very rough. Um, this is out of the frame, but uh, the wrapping paper has fallen off of the side of the table. He's sitting here at 2 minutes and 16 seconds. Yeah. Hey, 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 I did it faster than Kate, so I'm gonna win. Hold this! Time for our third contestant. Well, what is your name? Lily. You think you're gonna win? Probably not. She's honest. Okay, okay three, two, one, start. What is your technique? Um, I don't know. She doesn't know. Well, Grizzlies, those are some really good presents. Signing up from GTV. I'm Sam Chapin. And I'm Ari Smith. Back, Back to, to you in the studio. studio. Thanks, Abby. I'm sure Kate will appreciate that. I love Christmas caroling. So do I. You know, I heard Lindley was going Christmas caroling around the school. Let's go check it out. Hey, Grizzlies, I'm Lindley Shurik, and today we're going to go caroling. Let's go. Sweet silver bells all seem to say, throw cares away. Christmas is here, bringing a cheer to young and old, meek and the bold. Ding dong, ding dong, that is the song. Winter for me, the caroling. Once you sing here, words of good cheer from everywhere filling the air. Oh, how they come, raising the sun. Oh, how they dance, all in the sun. Gaily they bring, all people sing songs of good cheer. Christmas is here. Merry, 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 merry Christmas. Merry, 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 merry Christmas. On and they send on without end their joyful tone to every home.
wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring to you and your kid. Good tidings for Christmas and a Happy New Year. Wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring to you and your kid. Good tidings for Christmas and a Happy New Year. Caroling was invented by Franciscan friars. The word, word caroling actually means dance or a song of praise. Caroling was invented to go house to house giving well wishes during the colder months. Wow, Grizzlies, that really put me in the Christmas mood. Now signing off from GTV, I'm Lindley Sherrick and back to you in the studio. Wow, you guys sounded amazing. I know, right? Hey, I heard Lily was doing a gingerbread house contest. That's cool. Let's go see how it goes. Hi Grizzlies, welcome back to another episode of GTV. My name's Lily Bodenhammer. Today we'll be doing a GTV gingerbread bake-off. Let's go. And the winner is number two. Congratulations, Isabella, you won. The world's largest gingerbread house was built in Texas in 2013. It was 60 feet long, 42 feet wide, and over 20 feet at its highest point. They used over 22,000 candies to decorate, and it was altogether 35 million calories. Wow, those gingerbread houses were amazing. Congratulations, Isabella. Now, signing off from GTV, my name's Lily Bodenhammer. Back to you in the studio. Congrats, Isabella. I loved your gingerbread house. Hey, Reagan, have you seen the new bulletin board by Miss Garricky's room? Yeah, the one about winter holidays? Let's go to Aiden to learn more about Winter Holiday. Today, we will be doing a holiday skit featuring Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, and Christmas. Let's go. There are so many different holidays to celebrate this winter. So many different cultures. Hey, you. You're an evil person. You have to endure all three of my challenges. Let's go. What? Wait, how did we get here? Never mind that. The first of the challenges is a Hanukkah one. A traitor one, in fact. Oh, now what's this behind your ear? A perfectly fine dreidel. You're gonna challenge me to a battle of the dreidels to see which dreidel can stay spinning the longest. Let's go. Ha, I won. Ah, snowflakes. Wait, where did the dreidel thing go? Oh, I dropped it. Never mind that. Now for our next challenge, the Kwanzaa challenge. This is called the cup and the candle challenge. Allow me to present the cup and the candle. Oh, now what's this behind your ear? A cup and a candle. How convenient. I will lay them out like so. Um, I think that one. The next challenge will be a Christmas challenge to test the ultimate ability, Christmas ability. Whoever can draw the better Christmas tree in a certain amount of time wins. Oh, what's these behind your ear? A paper marker, 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 and marker. Use them wisely. You have five minutes.
and time. Time for you to show your painting. This is all I had time for. Haha, <laughs> I will surely win then. Here's my painting, and I only used one color. <sighs> How can I compete? Wait a second, that's not a Christmas tree! Oh darn, I forgot what a Christmas tree looks like. Ah. <laughs> Wait, so does that mean I won? You know, perhaps you did win. I guess I shall reveal my true identity. I am Santa Claus. Santa, I'm your biggest fan! But seeing as how you beat me, I feel it is not right for me to have that title. It belongs to you. It's what I always wanted, thank you. Don't mention it, kid. I never did see St. Nick again, but I know I'll always remember the gift he gave me. What do you know about Hanukkah or Kwanzaa? Hanukkah is an eight-day-long Jewish celebration, and Kwanzaa was actually made in the U.S. Uh, what do you know about Kwanzaa? Um, it's from December 26th to January 1st, and on the sixth day they have a feast. Thank you. What do you know about Hanukkah? Uh, it's from December 18th to December 26th, and there's one candle every single day for eight days, and you get gifts every day. Thank you. That was a very uh, an interesting time. Uh, now signing off from GTV, I'm Aiden McCullough, and back to you in the studio. Thanks, Aiden. There's so many holidays I've never heard about. Well, that's all for us here in the GTV studio. Now signing off from GTV, I'm Reagan Reapy. And I'm Joni Perrin. And remember, Grizzlies, we're better together. The milkman, the paper boy, evening TV. Did I get delivered here? Somebody tell me, please. This old world confusing me. Clouds as mean as you've ever seen. Ain't a bird who knows your truth. Then a little voice inside you whispers. Never